Hey everybody, welcome back to Northern Lion Plays Tetris 99. Originally, I was only going to do four Tetris 99s, but this is the danger of Tetris 99, baby. The runs have been fresh and so good. 95 wins. We got five wins in four eps. It's a good, it's a good situation. To be honest with you, that last uh, win that we got was also like very chef's kiss. We got pretty lucky, but also we fought. We fought hard. We fought well. I wonder what, do you think we're a Pokemon? I mean, we must be a Pokemon to somebody else, right? I hope I'm Lotad. He's, he's a cool dude. Where's Lotad? I, ju I just started attacking him. Let's preserve him. Oh, no! Oh, yes. Have we done it? I think we've done it. Okay. Enjoy your one tile wide setup, sweetheart. We're good to go. Again. Stoked. Pretty, like, uh, decent run of form, especially considering. I wouldn't really say, like, I'm super out of practice, but. You know, I could be more in practice. Put it that way. Also got a really itchy nose. Occasionally you gotta stop. You gotta you gotta put a little itch reduction measure into play. If you don't believe me, I don't know what to say. I didn't mean for that to rhyme. It just sort of happened that way. I don't even can I is there any way to turn off the sound? that happens when I get a Tetris because I don't want it to send a message to my brain that one Tetris is good enough for a reward. If you get four Tetrises in a row, it should say, nice try, sweetheart. If you get 14 Tetrises in a row, it should say, ooh, that stings. If you get 150 Tetrises in a row, then it should go, nice job, your father and I are very proud of you. That's my... That's my plan to... Bring the world of Tetris 99. Ah, and do a radical new future! Help! We can't really suggest uh, that this is anything but deserved right now. Played a, a pretty bad little setup there, and you know what? Almost got punished for it. <laughs> Almost. <laughs> Almost got punished. Ooh, that stings. It's like he spent his life savings of blocks to try to get us. And I'm still standing. Please let... Okay, you know what? If you're not going to let me attack attackers, then so be it. We're just going to send lines to the entire population. Wow. Uh, this is what we call uh, doubling down on a bad mistake here. But I think we're actually kind of out of it. It's all right. Usually, the Joy-Con drift, you just sort of let it go for a minute. You know, let it... Oh, I'm a big angry Joy-Con. Hear me roar. Oh, yes, you are. Who's a big, angry Joy-Con? And then, you, uh... Just kind of take a moment. Alright, well, it might not work. Just remember, Joy-Con, you can't spell Joy-Con without joke, okay? So just remember what that makes you in my eyes. Spiced? Spice decision. You have a chance to unspice the spice. Great work. I'm gonna be honest. It's not gonna be easy to build momentum here. <laughs> yeah, okay. What have you done? That's what you've done. That's what you've done. Probably making everybody pretty angry would be my guess. Not really, you know, accomplishing this for any meaningful 
you know, we're not getting any strategic benefit out of this, is what I'm trying to say. It, it is kind of humorous from time to time, I suppose. If it fits your prosaic definition of, of so-called humor. If we win like this, somebody on my subreddit said this is like um, some Star Wars A New Hope stuff. It's like I've turned off my targeting computer and the, the force ghost of Dan Giesling is guiding my performance. I mean, we're pretty close to making the top 10. Which is a milestone in and of itself. And then to also have the added hindrance of Joy-Con Drift is kind of funny. Let's just lean into it. Radio silence, I suppose. Of course, doesn't equate to regular silence because uh, it's a little noisy right now. I apologize for that. I mean, we deserve to lose, but also, like, I love you, Nintendo, but what the, what the heck, you know? Console's, like, two years old. <laughs> People are like, why don't you just buy new Joy-Cons? Okay, you are you don't have a, a bad position. I should just buy new Joy-Cons. Yes. But at the same time, it's like, there's a matter of principle. In fact, this, this console is like, a year old. But, you know, it's just a matter of principle at this point is more like why uh, why am I forced to buy a new controller after a year of using the console when uh, I have a, a Game Boy Color that was released in the year 1998 that's been through the washer and dryer about 17 times and it works better than ever the Pokemon Yellow cartridge still has my save game on it somehow from when I was like 11 years old anyway I'm not saying I got a leg to stand on here it's a business expense. I will I will concur. I actually like I legitimately believed for a while there. Would we have won were it not for the villainous Joy-Con drift? It nobody could possibly know. Anybody who says like yeah, they're lying. They got something to sell you. Again, you gotta take a little issue with the way that we did this. But we did do it. Do it. We did. That has to be handled. Honestly, that's pretty okay. Alright, yeah, get that. Okay, maybe you shouldn't take issue with the way that this went down. Also, that was just terrible placement. Followed by pretty sweet placement. This one has the makings of uh, a disastrous moment. That's what I was going to say the whole time. I promise. Never mind. See, like, I'm. If you learn anything about life from the Tetris 99 series, and I don't know if there is, a, you know, any enduring life lessons, though I've tried. The number one thing that I think it would be advantageous to learn is that there's like a, in, in a lot of situations, there's kind of a grace period on mistakes, you know? You can make a mistake as long as you don't ignore it or double down on it. 
many times you can pull yourself out of a mess. If you ignore it, double down on it, it's only going to become, you know, that much harder to deal with. You handle it as soon as possible. Got nothing to worry about. I'm I'm lost in the sauce right now. I, I'll just say it, you know. I didn't really have a plan for getting through this situation. Regardless, the situation has been gotten through. Two attackers. One has badges. This is where you run your evaluation algorithm. I'm going to build... Un okay, now I'm going to go to KOs. So originally, I was going to build until somebody decided they wanted to attack me. Or alternatively, if we picked up maybe a few more attackers, I might have considered it more prudent. That's not bad. Looks bad. Sometimes those temporary measures, those compromises, you've got what you need to get yourself through. Compromising gets a bad rap sometimes. I'm not that guy. I like a good compromise. Some people have a bad attitude. They say a compromise is a French word. It means when nobody's happy. I think it's a... People who view the world in a zero-sum context freak me out. I think it's weird. You know, we're in this together. Why are you trying to constantly beat people in the, in the game of life? I mean, in the game of Tetris, you don't really have a choice. In the game of life, you got a choice. Just don't be weird, forehead. Okay, I, I don't like what I did here. I'm free. <laughs> but I really did not like what I was doing there. Now I feel okay about it. But there was a window where that was real scary. We got a blue coming up. Okay, it's fair enough. So you're going to break this down. You're going to pop this down here. You're going to toss that blue beak. Everything's going hunky dory. Clear this out. Two attackers, okay. I'll oblige. Not building as much momentum as I would like here. But it's hard to build momentum when you're beset on all sides. So I'm hoping, and I think it'll happen, but I'm hoping for certain. Had to be done. We can knock some people out. Okay, business, business accomplished. Pretty sure that's not a real expression, but it should be. You can say it after all of your important business meetings. Ha <laughs> ha! Business accomplished. Never forget, sir, as you fade into oblivion, you attack me, not the other way around. Gotta handle this real quick. Sorry, I've been kind of like in proto radio silence for a bit here, just making sure. Sometimes I don't realize how long I've gone without speaking. Then I watch like the video to make sure the audio actually works. And I go like, what the heck is my mic broken? Not broken, just thinking. Put me on randos, dude. Oh, 
Oh, that's such a huge whiff. If you're ever gonna take a time to panic, I guess could have been worse. That not I thought that was decent. He has a, an indomitable spirit. A never say die attitude. You have to admire the true heart of a champion. You have to admire the heart of a champion. Krista, you did a great job. You had me on the ropes, and to be honest, I was fairly concerned that we were going to be destroyed. Instead, we came out with one of... Every victory means something to me. That one meant a little bit more than average. That takes us... I don't even remember. 96? <laughs> okay. Good, good work. We're back. It's been a great session. <laughs> Yesterday, when I streamed... I had 90 wins. We're up to 96 or 97 now. That's, uh, that's a pretty good two-hour stretch of Tetris. Two and a half, maybe. What do I chalk it up to? Oh. Is this an interview? I never thought I would be interviewed for my Tetris skills. This is very flattering. Um, well, I chalk it up to, uh, a lot of different things, Bob. Um... You know, uh, occasionally I can be a little bit uh, surly, but still I always appreciate the feedback that has helped me uh, get to where I'm trying to get to. Couldn't have done it without a number of uh, Tetris aficionados in the world of chat telling me, uh, you know, what's good advice and, and what's bad advice that sounds good. And there is a, a marked difference. There is a marked difference apart from that uh, just get good forehead is really strong advice if you're considering getting involved in Tetris 99 esports inspired perhaps by this very video um, I would say some of the best advice you could possibly have is just get good forehead it hurts to hear but just get good forehead I understand it's you know it sounds like it's not actionable criticism, but it is. Just get good forehead means practice. There's no shortcut to success. You know, in the world of Dark Souls, 
What's the secret to beating a boss? Well, they take a little bit of extra damage to this, and, you know, if you're really stuck, you might try this to give you an edge, but really, you know, if you just learn how to dodge their patterns, forehead, you won't die anymore. It's good advice. It's the good advice that you just can't take. Look at that, you left yourself a little one tile wide there. My boy's growing up! Ooh, and screwing up apparently. There we go. They're starting to feel the burn. I can't. Can't blame them. Felt the burn myself. Don't see that too often. Get two long pieces, stack them side by side. make two square pieces, the most valuable possible assortment in the entire Tetris 99 universe. Okay, no radio silence, but what we're going to do is build quickly. I know it could have fooled me. Because while we've got this aggression, it will be nice capitalize on it even further than we already have. Maybe this will be enough. Okay, feels good. Got a nice two tile wide setup. Anytime we can get back to that two tile wide, oh, it feels good, dude. We're running our own algorithm. Computers don't know how good they got it, brother. All they gotta do is do what they're told. Human beings, we gotta come up with strategies. Oh, do this, don't do that. Can't you read the sign? The sign said, long-haired hippie people, need not apply. So I tucked up my hair way right under my hat and I went in to ask him why. He said, son, you look like a fine, upstanding young man. I think you do. I took off my hat and said, imagine that. Me working for you. And then Albert Einstein handed me a crisp $100 bill. Why do you do this to yourself? Like, we're in this together. We're two high-level Tetris players. You've got badges. You're, you're wasting your badge potential by sending me. If you really want it, just beat me in the top 10, you know? Like, this is not the right time to be getting all, like, strategic, you know? Just yeet the people who are bad. You're gonna... You're gonna die by being a fool, by being stubborn. Or maybe you're gonna kill me, I don't know, I haven't really... haven't figured out how this looks yet. You could use some help. See, like, you did that to yourself. There was no need for this. And now, you know... You like that story so much? Here's a freaking sequel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got the long piece. What did, I did I tell you it was a sequel? I thought I told you it was a sequel. Apparently, a lot of people out here not well versed in the rules of game theory. They gotta watch the uh, 2001 film A Beautiful Mind, starring Russell Crowe. Jennifer Connolly. Radio silence, by the way. Paul Bettany. I think Paul Bettany's in that one. AKA Vision. Not good. 
Bail me out, Buttercup, baby. What? You might take issue with what I'm about to say. We place the piece. I felt the piece snap in my brain. Oh, this will be a new one. What? We won? I didn't do anything. Okay, okay, <laughs> okay. A better YouTuber would make you wait. They'd make you wait a day to see if we can hit the trifecta. Not me. Not me. I don't... We didn't do anything. Like, I'm, I'm just being sincere. We didn't do anything to win that one. I don't understand what happened. We placed... We survived until everybody else died of old age. I'll take it. This is... You, this is maybe the second chance we've had in two months to try to get three wins in a row, which gives you a very special badge that only a very small, select few Tetris 99 players have. So this is... Like, I, I... I'll tell you, if I feel nervous, I don't feel nervous. Don't equate that with feeling like I got it locked in. Because that's not... The truth. But I have it on good authority that you can't handle the truth anyway. So why am I bothering you? Why are we having this conversation about the truth when I've, I've heard from a reputable source that you can't even handle the truth? Like, okay. I like it. Still like it. You know what I like as well, is having so many attackers, I can't even see what the heck's happening. I'm- it sounds facetious, a lesser mind would- would be sarcastic there. It's not the case. I'm actually stoked. Because when that happens, it means you're doing something right. Okay, so we got a one tile wide. Ain't nothing wrong with the one tile wide. And there ain't no cure for the summertime blues. Don't know who sang it. If I did, I would give attribution. I'm sorry, sir. I saw somebody was like... Somebody was in the red there, but... Well, we've hit a new era of ascension in Tetris 99. If we can miss drops in the top three and still win somehow. Um, so that's exciting. Little scary. Blue piece coming. Nod your head. Not a good placement. That's okay. Look at that. Good rebuild. Three kills, 25% up. Wouldn't mind... Being a little bit up on that. What have I done? That's ill-advised, what I've done here. But I, what I've done is kick the problem slightly down the road. And we're building Swiss cheese now. Let's just relax. Step one of this, this newfound program is relaxation. Step two is get out of it, I'll admit. Apparently we had somebody with a few badges attacking us. Could have fooled me because I felt no pressure whatsoever. That's like a super garbage build for no reason at all. Somebody's feeling it. I think I saw a cowardly switch. And not of the Nintendo variety. People died there. I, di I didn't do it. But there was... There was death. 
Nido, the deity of pestilence and disease. You know, this is actually a little hot. I took myself off of that, not out of a sense of fear necessarily, but out of a sense of like, you know, a, a, an ounce of preparation is worth a pound of freaking cure. You know what I mean? I don't want to make it easy. If you're gonna defeat me, you have to use your strongest potions. We gotta be on tactics here. That's like, that's a no brainer. Great time to receive two long pieces. I also just have peripheral vision. I see some more badges likely to come my way. I see some more badges likely to come my way. Now, calm thyself. Yes. We're in here. There's a chance. But it could all go up in a puff of smoke. You are not immortal. Just play your game. We got a lot on us. I wouldn't have it any other way. This, these are big invests. <laughs> Radio silence. There are those who said it would never be accomplished. There are those who thought a Herculean task such as three wins in a row, it couldn't be done. It couldn't be done. But you know what? We did it. It wasn't even hard. It wasn't even hard. 98 wins. Okay, I don't want this to get muted. If you enjoyed the video Click the like button and also subscribe. Da -da 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 -da. See you tomorrow.